Hello there and welcome. So what the heck is a UDI and what is it used for? And as you can see on the screen, a UDI, I believe stands for uh, Umbraco Document Identifier. It has a protocol associated with it. It has a uh, content type associated with it and what looks like a GUID with the hyphens removed from it. And so that's important because if we look into a fresh install of a Umbraco uh, back office here, we have things like Content Editor I'm sorry, Content Picker, that actually uses something now called Content Picker 2. And we have the Media Picker and the Member Picker. See the number two appended to some of these. And that's important because when we actually use those, um, it will save our documents with things like uh, UMB colon slash slash document and then the GUID. And in fact, there's even a whole API interface dedicated to this where you have UDIs, and that'll be important when you're actually using uh, or extending Umbraco. And here we can see the different uh, formats that you see there. Now, interestingly enough, if we flip back to uh, here, you can't actually use the old media picker, the old content picker, or the old uh, member picker. And that, I believe, multi node tree picker may actually do the same thing here too, and it does. The reason is, is because you no longer have the choice of using the old ones, which are integer based, and the new ones, which are UDI based. And the reason seems pretty clear that if I give you an integer, I, I really fail to have any context with my content, as opposed to if I give you a full UDI, I have an idea which API to use it with. So anyway, that is basically what a UDI is and why it's going to be a part of your future.